We're here on the south side and the Liberty Bridge is just behind me here. And across the river, you have commuters that are navigating their way, trying to get home from work. But whatever way they find, it'll probably be a little bit better today than it will be over the next two days. That's what we're being told by PennDOT. It might be pretty difficult to imagine a longer and more frustrating commute than the drive into town this morning. And obviously you had motorists uh, scattered all about on different roadways. But it was still better than what's expected for the next two days. Apparently the morning commute was lighter than normal. Engineers expect that to change. So the real headache will likely occur Wednesday and Thursday, according to PennDOT. Basically to, uh, tomorrow and Thursday could be worse than this morning then. Uh, we would anticipate that's possible. We don't know that we had full volume of traffic. We're expecting tomorrow and Thursday to be our busiest days. PennDOT says in light of the congested detour, drivers are encouraged to consider public transit for the rest of the week. Drivers are also encouraged to access longer routes that would avoid congested areas. As for the Liberty Bridge, engineers must design and install a new strut to stabilize the structure. On the outside of this damaged beam so that ultimately this strut will carry the load that the beam used to carry. So it promises still to be a long week and PennDOT says ultimately the Liberty Bridge again should reopen on Monday. Reporting live from the south side, Sheldon Ingram, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.